So this question is a diagram question. I know that because of the diagram provided here. So what I like to do, and you don't have to necessarily do this, um, but what I like to do is to label my diagram with any information that I know, even before reading the question. So for instance, in this case, I know that I have a triangle here. I'm just tracing the sides of that triangle. I know that I have two angles here in 72 degrees and 57 degrees. And I know that all three angles of that triangle must add up to 180. So I'm going to take my calculator and just figure out what the missing angle must be. And what I find is that this angle on the right side must be 51. Secondly, I know that all of the angles labeled X, Y, and Z are supplementary angles to the angles that we have. So for instance, 180 minus 51, which is 129, is what angle Z must be. And 180 minus 72 is what angle Y must be, so 108. And 180 minus 57 is what X must be, which is 123. Right, so I've essentially now filled out this entire diagram. There's no other angle here that I need to know. So let's read the question. So given the triangle shown below with exterior angles that measure X, Y, and Z as shown, what is the sum of X, Y, and Z? Oh, well, great. So I already figured out what, the, what X, Y, and Z are. So I'm literally just adding 123 plus 108 plus 129. And I'll throw all of that into my calculator. So 123 plus 108 plus 129. Now what I get is 360, and therefore my answer is choice J. And now that I think of it, there's a simpler way to answer this question. In fact, the sum of the exterior angles to any polygon are always, or is always, uh, 360. I forgot about that rule, right? So if you knew that, then you would answer it right away with choice J. If you didn't, then you can do it the way that I have here. Even if you had read the question first and then decided to fill out the diagram after having read it instead of doing it the way that I did, which was fill out first, nothing wrong with that, right? The whole point is that you get the right answer and that you understand how and why you got it. So that's it.